Wait one second. Is it working? Yes. Get past that to open bed. Oh, that's gonna be so loud. Okay, hello and welcome to Pokemon Platinum version. Ow. So, hopefully you are all doing okay today and staying safe. Now, it took a while to set this up, but I could not, you know, figure out how to sing you the top bit and, you know, to get rid of my bottom task bar. So we're going to have to play through the entire game like this. But hopefully you are all doing okay today and staying safe. Hello there, it's so nice to finally meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. Now this is very loud for me, so if I speak louder than normal it's because it's very loud. My name is Rowan. However, everyone just calls me the Pokemon Professor. Before I go any further, is this your first adventure? If you need any advice, I'm certainly capable of giving it. No info needed. Wait. Oh. It looks like I can't actually turn this off for you. That's probably so bad for you. I'm probably just gonna keep it down. Okay, I'll just keep it that and may just continue on from now. This world is widely inhab inhabited and no not inhabited. Inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. Here I have a Pokeball. I remember it took a second to try and figure out what I was supposed to do here because I was just trying to quickly go through it to, you know, test the game. Touch the button on the middle of the Pokeball if you please. Oh, it's Paniri! Oh, that's a great Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon as friends. Let me clean my glasses. At times we play together, and at other times we work together. Some people use their Pokemon to battle and develop closer bonds with them. What do I do? I conduct research so that we may learn more about Pokemon. Yeah, Pokemon Platinum is one of my favourite Pokemon games. Like I would rate it as, you know, the top one that I like. The first one that I played was Pokemon Y. And that was back when it released, or around when it released. Now, now, why don't you tell me about yourself? Hmm. I'd probably just go with the Dawn character. Alright, yes, continue on. Uh, let's see. Wait, you can actually go war for that? Oh, I've been using the, you know, big cat, well, the big, you know, letters for a long time. Totally forgot that there was lower case for this. I think, oh. And I'll talk more of once we get past this bit. Yes, gone. I need to get through this as fast as possible. So you're thinking, what you, a fine name that is. Now, this boy here, I believe he's your friend. What should they be named this character? Yeah, I got a great name. We call you Berry. After Blueberry. Uh, let's see. Okay, that should work. Blueberry W. It was supposed to have a C, but we didn't have room for that. No, wait, I, I think I can put WC if I just, you know, your name. Blue, or just Berry. Uh, let's see. The starting bit has taken a little while. I remember I used to never, wait, I remember getting stuck on the, you know, front screen for a very, very long time. I think it took me an hour before I realised that I needed to click the button of the Pokeball. So that's just a stupid, you know, thing that I wanted to share. Old memory of me being, you know, stupid of 
not remember that I had to, you know, click the button. Alright, Tenku, this time has come. Your very own tale of a grand adventure is about to be unfolded. So I was about to begin now. Uh, on your journey, you will meet countless Pokemon and people. I'm sure that along the way, you will discover many things, perhaps even something about yourself. Now, go on, leap into the world of Pokemon. Okay, let's see. Well, it looks like we start our Pokemon adventure. So, I had the choice of starting Pokemon Platinum, Poke Pokemon Soul Silver, or Pokemon White 2. But I decided to start Platinum, and I got Platinum, because it was a, one of my favourite ones to play through, and I think I've played through this tons of times. And then, oh, Soul Silver. I think I've played somebody else's save for a long time. I can't remember their name. I wish I remembered their name. Well, uh, let's see. Was it Ben? Nah. That concludes our, our special program. Let's ask Professor Rowan. Brought to you by Jub Jubilife TV on na Nationwide Net. They don't really talk about that. It's nationwide, so as a region, the nation. That's very. Oh look, there's Barry WC. Go subscribe to him, Hello Barry WC. But under line bit at WC. There you are. Hey Tinkle, did you just see the TV? Sure you did. Professor Rowan, that's a really important guy. Who studies Pokemon, right? That means he must have lots and lots of Pokemon. So we ask him, I bet he'd give us some Pokemon. What are you doing on my computer, mate? Get off of there. Oh hey, this is the new PC. There's actually a laptop. Is it? A, no, I think it is a PC. Uh, where was I? Oh right, right. We're going to see Professor Rowan and get some Pokemon. I'll be waiting outside. Okay, thank you. If you're late, I'm going to find you 10 million Poke Dollars. Well, that was, you know, very talkative guy there. Poke Basics. Uh, I don't want to read all that. No, I did not want to... Uh, where's my back button? It's Q, that's my back button. And I move my mouse. But hopefully you are all doing okay today and staying safe. Tinko! Already left. Very already left. Don't know what it was about, but he sure was in a hurry. Well, let's go start our adventure. The last time that we were on a Pokemon adventure was Pokemon Bronze. But we did actually do some t tiny games that we never actually did much of because they either didn't work or the battery in the game didn't work or yeah, I didn't like it. Uh, let's see. But now we get to start, you know, entirely different game. Oh yes, Tinko. Don't go into the tall grass, wild Pokemon might attack you. It would be okay if you had your own Pokemon, but you don't. So, we'll take care, sweetie. Well, take care, sweetie. Oh, the snow, that's the best part about Pokemon Platinum. Wait, is that? That's a weird glitch with me facing forest. Did you see that? Let me move my mouse. That little area up there. That's a little line there. Ah, well. It is a very old game. They did make the remake, you know, not that long ago. Hiya, Tenko. Barry was looking for you. I think he's home now. Why don't you check it out? You know, before I always used to call him Barry, but I'm just gonna call him Barry from now on. But. Barry. What was that about? Oh, hey, Tango. Hey, 
Okay, I'm going to see the Professor Wood. He should come to and quickly. I wish I had some running shoes. Oh, jeez. I got something. May as well go inside. There is Mum. Oh, hi, Tenko. Did you come calling on Barry? Was gone for a second, but then he came running right back home. Can't just sit still. Uh, I wonder what he takes. Who he takes after? Do you not even know the father? That's pretty weird. Oh, who was uh, Beth Barry's father again? Uh, I don't remember. Did they ever show Barry's father? Barry, I better take my bag and journal too. Oh, hey, thank you. I'll be waiting on the road. It's ten million fine if you're late. Who just yells I'm gonna find you ten million dollars? We got some running shoes around here. Uh, let's see. I think the last Pokemon game that we properly played through was Pokemon Bronze, and then we also did do a two small Pokemon games, but we didn't actually get past the beginning of them. And I do still have a few Pokemon games that I've not played yet, just haven't got around to you know playing them. But I decided to start this after you know we finished Halo Two. Uh, what was the other one? Hmm. What was the other game that we finished? Ah yes, Encodia. After we finished Encodia and the you know, Halo 2 recently, I might as well start a Pokemon series. And I'm very interested in trying to get as far as we can in this Pokemon series. Uh, let's see. Wait, I want to check my mic a second. Yeah, that should be working. It is very loud, uh, you know, music, so I might actually turn that down a little bit more. Hopefully you can hear me properly. Eh, uh, let's see. Alright, let's get moving to Professor Rowan's lab. Why are you going in the grass, mate? Why don't go into the grass, right? No worries, no problem. It doesn't matter. We don't have any Pokemon. Trust me. If we get... Trust me, I... On this one. I've got an idea. Now listen. Sorry, there was just something on the ground there. I think it was just a wire. Now listen. You know how to, how wild Pokemon jump out when you go into the tall grass? So what you do is you scoot over to the next patch of grass before any wild Pokemon can appear. If we just keep dashing, we can get to Sand Gem Town without running into running into wild Pokemon. Okay, stick with me. Okay, here we go. On your marks. Hold it. Professor. You two don't seem to have any Pokemon between you. Then what does it mean of you going into the tall grass? Silence. Hey Tenko, this old guy is Professor Rowan, isn't it? What's he doing here? They tried to go into the tall grass because they wanted Pokemon. Hmm, what to do? Their world would surely change if they were to meet Pokemon. Is it right for me to put them in on that path? Hmm. You two truly love Pokemon, do you? Yes. Me too. I love Pokemon too. 
I will ask you once again. You two truly love Pokemon, do you? What? You can ask a hundred times. The answer will never change. We'll both answer a hundred times. We love Pokemon. Right, Tango. A pair of reckless kids who foolishly try to enter tall grass. Wild Pokemon of their own. It worries me. Sorry, I was just trying to see if I had a speed up button or not. It worries me that people like that could do what like that would do with Pokemon. Uh well I I uh Well then forget about me but give a Pokemon to my friend here. It was me who tried to go into the tall grass and all. How big of you? Very well then. I will entrust you two with Pokemon. I'll apologize apologize for putting you through that exercise. However, you must promise me that you will never recklessly endanger yourselves again. Now then. Hmm. Now where... Lucas. Professor Rowan, you left your briefcase behind, at the lake. Something wrong here. Ah, there it is. Lucas, nice work. What I was about to do was entrust these two with their own Pokemon. What? Those Pokemon are crucial. You're giving them away? We hmm. this side by side with Pokemon. There comes a time when Pokemon should meet. Well, people should meet Pokemon. <laughs> Pokemon should meet people. There's a world that should be explored together. For them today, is that time the place right here? I'm not very good at reading the CL text. Go on, open the briefcase and choose you a Pokemon. Really? Professor Room? I can't believe it. I'm so happy now that I can keep a straight face. Can't keep a straight face. Hey Tango, you can choose first. I'm practically a grown up. I have to show some class here. Well, what Pokemon should we pick? Hmm. Yes. Should we pick the Chimchar, the fire type? Now choose which Pokemon you will be. Should we pick Turtwig, the grass type? Chimchar, the fire type? Or Piplup, the penguin Pokemon, the water type? Well, it's obviously what I'm gonna choose, and that's Turtwig. As it was my first Sinnoh starter. Then I'll choose I'm picking this Chimchar. That will be a big problem for us in the future, but I already got a great idea of how we can you know, counter that fire type already. Very well, both of you have chosen a good Pokemon it seems. Now listen well, the Pokemon you have been entrusted with are unfamiliar with the world. In that regard, they're very much like you. As fellow newcomers to the new of the world, I hope you'll do well together. If you have any trouble, come see me at my lab in San Gemtown. And now we be on our way. There goes the Professor. Professor, wait for me! Oh, sorry folks. How do you really like, how do you like that? Professor Rowan is really nice. On TV he seems so stern and scary. Yeah, he is a very nice guy. His moustache kind of reminds me of like the 1800s moustache that they always, you know, 
He used to have like sideburns and all that back in the day. <laughs> Tango, we both got Pokemon now. There's only one thing to do, right? Are you up for this? Yes. I've always wanted to say this. It's time has finally come. Tenko, I challenge you to a battle. Okay, let's get ready. You think you can take me, Dune Berry? It's so weird because uh, the character is called Barry and we called it Berry. I'm pretty sure I used to call that character Barry a lot because I, you know, I wasn't very good at speaking. Eh, uh, let's see, Chimchar, level 5. Turtwig, level 5. I'm probably just gonna go withdraw. Our defense went down, but we used withdraw. Our defense went up. Chimchar used leer. Now, we tackle. We should be fine. What in that one hurt? You. Chimchar used leer. Yeah, we just sent these Pokemon that don't even know who we are and we're just telling them to use moves. We gotta withdraw. I've just gotta keep using withdraw for a little bit. Try and get our uh, defense back up. Chimchar used Leer. Yo, Leer is probably almost out of TP by now. No way, we can keep going. Take that. Tackle. This game came out 12 years ago, that's weird. Another uh, 8 years and it's at its 20th anniversary. Use tackle once more and we should take that chimchar down. That's just keep being used in the uh, layer over and over again. Come on, crit, crit, crit. Yes. That's us taking down our first battle with a very good victory. 69 XP points. Torchwig has gained XP. Level 6. Almost level 7. That's pretty good. Okay, what are you saying? We ended up losing. Tenko got $500 for winning their first battle. Ah, yes. Phew, let's go home. Yeah, need a rest after that. I'm beat up after that battle. My Pokemon needs rest too. See you, Tango. Kitchen stuff. Kitchen stuff. What's the matter, dear? Well, that's what happened to you. You and Barry are lucky to have met Professor Rowan. Imagine if you didn't. I would, wouldn't have liked to think what the wild Pokemon might have done to used to. Yo, Pokemon seem very deadly. Like there's Macargo that's at 40,000 degrees and that's about hotter than the sun's, you know, second, you know, inner area. Eh, uh, let's see. Tenko, go see Professor Rowan and thank him properly for your Pokemon. His lab is in Sand Gem Town, isn't it? Now that you have your own Pokemon, the tall grass wouldn't be so threatening. Why no, Tenko put these on. Tenko received a pair of running shoes. Ah, uh, that, that's going to be very useful. Go to Sam Jin Town, yes, yes, yes. We just got, you know, quickly.
Can we run now? Hmm. What's my... Ah! So Q is my running button. Oh, here's the uh, berry again. Too slow, Tenko. I'm sick of waiting. I'm going to see Professor Rowan so I can thank him properly. So I had this great idea. Listen up, okay? You know that the lake where we always play at? You know how they say a legendary Pokemon lives there? You guessed it. Let's catch that Pokemon. That'll make the Professor Rowan very happy. I'm sure of that. Me and your, you, together, we got nothing to fear. Well, I guess this is how we end up dying. Always love that little scarf animation. Alright, we are at the lake. Get ready because we are capturing that legendary Pokemon. Trust me on this one. It's here, it even says so on the sign. What's going on? The slowing, time, the expanding space. I'll make it all mine one day. Cyrus is my name, remember it. Until then, sleep while you can, legendary Pokemon of the lake. Bed? Allow me to pass, step aside. What was that about? Weird guy. Tango, let's catch that legendary Pokemon. Yeah! Oh, did you hear that? That Tango? That was a legendary Pokemon crying. That had to be it. This is our chance, let's catch it. Wait, wait, what? We don't have anything on us. You know, Pokeballs, Poke Ascent E Ball. <laughs> if we don't have those, we can't catch Pokemon or take them around with us. Do you think Professor Rome give, give, will give us some of we asked? You know, you remember what he said, don't you? He said to visit him at his lab if we needed anything. Okay, Tenko, I'll race you there. Plus one to Professor's lab in San Gem Town rules. Eh, well, let's see. Let's continue on our adventure now. I always loved the snow around here. I don't know what it was, but the snow around in this game was always cool. Oh, our plus wild Pokemon. There's a Bidoof. I do want to catch a Bidoof. But we don't have any Pokeballs on us now. So we tackle it. Uh, let's see. Wait, I, I figured out my speed up button. This tab. Now I can do training while on camera too. I thought, you know, it's probably going to take me as long as uh, the last time that I was doing uh, training on camera, like an hour or something. For uh, Pokemon Sweet, I was training up my Pokemon. Hi, I've been waiting for you. Please come with me. The professor is waiting to see you. Just go, uh, yeah. Just go ahead and. But, hey, what? That? Uh, oh, it's you, Tango. That old guy, he's not scary so much as he is totally out there. Well, it doesn't matter, Tango. I'm out here. See you later. That's weird. What was that? The friend always seems to be in a rush. Let's go in. Well, well, look who it, who's here. Tenko, was it? Let's have a look at your Pokemon. Hmm, I see. This Pokemon seems to be rather happy. Hmm, I'm trusting you with that, Turtwig. Was no mistake, it seems. Professor Will, 
Would you like to give her a nickname? Yes. Hmm. What kind of vegetable name can I give you? I got the perfect vegetable name to give you a cabbage. A perfect name for a green little... Or we could call you Tree. Or Leaf. Hmm. Cabbage or Leaf. Hmm. Let's try and see what a leaf name would look like. Leaf. Hmm. It's either cabbage or leaf. Hmm. Let me see. Hmm. Leafy. Hmm. Leaf four. Ah. Now we're coming up with some good names. Is it a leafy, leafo, or leafin? Nah. Leaf you? Leaf ba? Hmm. Leafo, leafy. Hmm. Let me try and figure out a good name for this. Cabbage leaf. Leafy, leafo, or leaf bar. Hmm. Hmm. Let me try and figure out this one a second. Hmm. What well, you know, many people probably use leaf, leafy, or leafo. Leafo kind of sounds like it's a Spanish name. with cabbage. So if I name this one cabbage, eh, we just gotta go with this. I'm, I might pick next time if we ever get another turtwig, Leafo, because I think that's a great name. It, it kind of sounds Spanish, Leafo. Or it sounds like Leap, you know, Leafo, Op off of something. Uh, let's see. When I first saw you two about to step into the tall grass about Pokemon, I was shocked. I was astounded by these foolhardy children. But now you have astounded me in an entirely different way. Already there is a bound growing between you and that Pokemon. I feel privileged to have met you. I'm sure Turtwick feels the same way about you. Turtwick of yours. Boy, I'm glad you kind, you're kind toward Pokemon. Toward Pokemon, yes. As I was, you know, misspelled there. Towards would have been better. If you weren't, well, I don't even think even want to think about that. Hmm. Let's move on to the next topic. There's something I want to, you to do for me. Allow me to properly introduce myself. First, my name, as you know, is Rowan. I study Pokemon. First of all, I want to know exactly what kind of Pokemon live in the Sinnoh region. To do so, it is necessary to collect data using the Pokedex. This is what I wish to ask of you, and I want to entrust you with this Pokedex. Will you use it to, to record data all the Pokemon in the Sinnoh for me? Yes. Hmm, good answer. Thank you obtained the Pokedex. Yes, we all know what Pokedex does, so I'm just going to yeah, speed this up.
That's a lot of text. Just to get through the start of the game. Oh wait, I can start moving now? Well, it looks like we can now finally continue. Tangle. It looks like it's just opened the door to say, you know, Oh, can you pick me up some milk at the store or something? I have something good here. You should take this as well. I obtained TM27. That could be very useful. That is the technical machine that one contains the move return. That is going to be very useful. Oh yeah, old Pokemon uh, TMs only have one use in this generation. Ah. We need to remember that. No go spending if it's not going to be worth it. Uh, let's see, teach you the move to instantly to your Pokemon. Bear in mind, however, that T a TM is only single use only. The move return gives power the more friendly your Pokemon is with you. Uh, let's see. We all know what return does. Well, I'll be the professor at TMs. Okay, I think we're just gonna get shown around a few stuff. Yes, that's a Pokemon over there too. Is that a Pokemon set? That's a Pokemon the lab. Yeah, right. You should let your family know you're helping Professor put together this thing. Uh, let's see. My Pokemon's already fully leveled up, huh? There you go. Did you tell your family? What happened? I bet you didn't, did you? I know you are eager to see all kinds of Pokemon, but you shouldn't make your mum worry like that. Well, let's quickly... It's probably better to just run through, yeah, it's probably better. It's so hard having y'all. Uh... Wait one second. So what? Let me just look at my uh... key hot key control config. Where is Q? I make that R. But Y is also R, so I make that T. But that's also T, so I make that Y. Okay, that's a little bit better. Now we can finally continue on our journey. How long has it been? 38 minutes already? Well, I might as well save if I can remember what key it... No, it's not that. Is it Y? Ah. It is Y. 33 minutes spent in game. Uh, let's see, let's just... It took forever to save my data. Hopefully nothing went wrong and this can actually be a series. Tango we'll saved the game. Ah. Let's run back home. Oh, you got to oh, that's that's one of the Pokemon that I want to grab, a, a Starly, that's what we need to grab. I'm just going to speed this up so we can get to um, our house faster. Take that. One more tackle, there. Yep, yep, that's it, that one. We're level 7. Oh, I'm clicking S. I was wondering why I was not moving to the side there. Well, we go back and talk to our mother. I'm seeing that there is a weird uh, bug running downwards. You can see the little outside box of your character. Uh, let's see. I think that's your hitbox. Well, it's actually not a hitbox, but you know, kind of a hitbox. Welcome home, Tenko. Are your, you and your Pokemon healthy? 
Just made dinner, take a quick rest here. What is it, Tinko? Wow, Professor Rowan asked you to do something that big? Okay, dear, go for it. Your mum's got your back. I know, Tenko, I got something that you'll find useful. Obtain journal. Wait, did we get Pokeballs already? No, we get that from a uh, thingy not that long after this. Oh, yeah, we can now take you know, what we did last. I remember that bit of the game. Uh, let's see. Well, hopefully you enjoyed, you know, the start of Pokemon Platinum, you know, part one. Excuse me, is my little berry here? Oh, no, he's not. Oh, then he must have left already. What to do? That boy shouted about going on an adventure and then bolted it. He's so headstrong and reckless. I at least wanted him to take this. Not to worry, Tenko will deliver that to him. Won't you, Tenko? Oh, really? You do that for me? Please, take this. For me. Parcel. Ah, is that Pokeballs or something? I don't know. Bye bye, Tenko. Enjoy your adventure. Okay, let's get into here. I want to get on our adventure as fast as possible. I want to at least catch my first Pokeball before we... Well, not Pokeball. First Pokemon, or two Pokemon before we... Well, I guess we can't get the second one until we get the... Uh, is it Jubilee City? Ah. There you are. Come on, take that, take that. Wow. We are getting so strong. I'm kind of just speeding up so we can go a little bit faster. I know it's kind of better to run everywhere. Oh, hello there, Lucas. How are you doing? Tenko, do you know how to catch a Pokemon? I demonstrate how to catch one. Everyone knows how to catch a Pokemon. You really catching a me do? Well, let's see, and that's how it's done. Very important, very important, very important, very important. I give you po five Pokemon to start with, Pokeballs to start with. Uh, let's see, see we around. Well, let's catch our first Pokemon. That is not what I wanted, but yeah, you know, just gotta take it out anyway. That was very strong. We almost got taken out there. We almost got destroyed by a Trickitoe. You know, we should not always run into, you know, battles like that if we don't know what the moves are. Eh, uh, let's see. You know, we could get a magic cart and get Gyarados. I think that could be a fun thing to get a Gyarados. Okay, now we can stop hitting the sign. I'm not very good with the controls. Hmm. A shrink. Destroy that shrink so it does not exist no more. Level 8 already? Our first Pokemon trainer is just up there and I do not think we should fight them now. I will catch this Bidoof because we do need a HM Slave. Or HM... You know, friend. Uh, let's see. 
Our new HM friend. Hmm. What should I name this Pokemon? No, not Cole. Ketchup, that's your name. That is what your name's going to be. So we name this Pokemon Ketchup. And I think it's a quite nice name. Ketchup the Badoo. Now, can we get what we want? Absolutely destroy that thing. That's just another we do. When do we get an EXP share? I think you get that later on in the game. It'd be nice to get that so we can level up our Bidoof. But I think Starly's in this route down here. But it's kind of night time in game, so... Yeah, there's that Starly, but I don't want that Starly. That one's too underleveled. That one's a bit underleveled too. Oh, I think that's the only one that we're going to get. Oh, Starly was caught! We got ourselves a Starly! Our third Pokemon coming to our team. Now, I have a special name for it, but I can't remember how to spell it. So I'm going to have to pull up, you know... Buffolo... Yeah. So it's going to be spelled like that. Buffolo. So, the reason why... What I'm gonna call this, what I'm gonna call this Pokemon is Buffalo Wings. Now, I originally had a Starly in my uh, first ever Platinum playthrough, and it was called Buffalo Wings, and I think it was a great name. How do you write Buffalo? Is that how you spell Buffalo? I think that's how you spell Buffalo. No, it's Buffalo. I don't think I've ever spelled Buffalo in a long time. Uh, WS for wings. Buffalo wings. Well, we need to switch train our... Uh, what's the... There it is. I should really change that, shouldn't I? Let me go change that a second. I know, you know, it's kind of annoying that I have to keep going through my thing. So, E... R... That can be E... Wait, I think I just messed something up there. I think I did something wrong. Yeah, I did mess up something. B. What? Ah. Uh, I think I just make it R. But R is my running button, isn't it? No, that's N R. That, I do not know what that is. How do I go back? Ah. No, that's not working. I had this all working before, but now I've messed everything up. I'm sorry about this. Uh, let's see. So, E. And then R. Yeah, just make that F. And G. And that can just be C. I 
Yeah, that that seems to be working probably. No, it's not that. It's G. Yes. Yeah. So I save. Ah, it's R. Ah, I know what I need to do. Sorry about this. Need to do something again. So R E. I normally keep my, you know, enter kind of button for doing text E because it's the closest button to, you know, W S A D. Well, uh, that's us saved, and I think I might just end it here for today. So have a nice day, safe, have toasty apple. Maybe even tomorrow, I just need to keep all day vitamins, very, very important. And bye bye, see you next time, have a nice day. See you, bye bye.